viewers and victorious creators of my channel today i am again participating in a collaboration video but this time it's a diy project and it's a challenge we have to go to dollar tree and shop for five dollars only and make something either to be used at home as a decor or we can also give it as a gift this challenge has been put together by Lori from Creative Lori and B from Bam B DIYs channels. And both of them are very creative ladies. They decided to organize this. So hopefully our ideas will help some of the ladies to kind of lighten up their life and prepare some gifts at home instead of going and looking for gifts from the different stores. So what I decided to do as I already had some items that I needed for this DIY, I bought only this type of hearts from Dollar Tree. I will show you later from a closer distance. And I came up with this idea of making napkin holders. My DIY cost me just two or three bucks the most, but if I decide to give it as a gift, it will look like I'm giving a gift of $15 minimum. So here is my coffee table. It's work in progress now, so everything is on top of each other. Let's start. For this DIY, you will need any type of water bottle. It's not an advertisement. I'm just sharing uh, what I'm using. It's from Costco. So I take out this part, the plastic. If you can't find this particular type, you may get any other type of bottles and take out this part. That's what we need. 50 scatters for $1. Well, for this type of napkin ring holder, you will need just one table scatter and one small piece of ribbon that I got from Dollar Tree. I got different colors to improvise and see which one is cute. I already prepared some strips like so and try to uh, put the glue in the middle. It's so hard to do it with one hand. Here I used both hands and I came with this. So in order to cover this part so the end won't be seen, you may just glue the pink heart on top. Well, as our pink heart is kind of too transparent, I thought of using any type of nail polish. You may choose white or fuchsia color or a little bit of pearlish color like this one. Because my hot glue sticks were kind of old, I tortured myself by gluing this small piece of ribbon. <laughs> while well, uh, if it was fresh it would be easier but you may also use e6000 glue it's better you may also use this type it's arts and crafts um, rhinestones 180 pieces in one pack and for one ring i have used 13 hearts so for the rhinestone version all you need is the ring your rhinestones and the hot glue gun. so this is the ribbon and table scatter version and this one is rhinestone version so the third version is this one i used some artificial rope or you may call it yarn maybe which came five colors in one pack red heart scatter i will use for the one with the rope i just need to hot glue it and that's it the ring is ready here are all four options as you can see i added another color on my pink heart scatter and these are the red with ribbon and red with the rope and here is the one with small hearts decide which one you like the most I like all four of them, but this is my favorite. And for giving as a gift, I'm gonna use these bags, which I got from 99 cent store long time ago. 
of course it's not counted towards my um, today's DIY it's just an idea that you may give as a gift by placing your napkin rings um, into this type of bags and give as a gift also I will include some uh, handmade card it came in a pack of 10 like this one and this was on top of it, it was for Valentine's Day so I'm using the small size to make a card and write some note that it's a handmade gift so my host will be happy to receive it that's it guys hope you like the idea of this DIY white rings and if you like it don't forget to put your thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and comment as well as go and check Lori's and B's channels let them know that you came from my channel and subscribe to their beautiful channels as well and thanks for staying with me till this moment and see you in my next video bye bye everyone